Hey guys, this is Khadeen and you are watching Grow with Khadeen. In this video, I am going to share with you that how you can create super easy and super fast websites using InstaWP. And it is free to try so you don't have to pay anything for trials or you don't have to pay anything in upfront because you can try it. If you like it, you can go with the plan. Otherwise, you can just stick to the free one. You can check out the free one. So how to use it? I will not waste your time. We'll just go straight forward and we will just explore all the features and if you like this video if you like the uh, process of creating the websites and I am sure that you will like it then you can go with Insta WP or you can leave it now to go to the website go go to link in description you will get the link in description or you can just search uh, uh, go to your top bar and search for webifiedhub.com slash insta wp just go there and you will be directed to the insta wp main home page and here we are now what we have to do is here we have to do all the onboarding first of all and then we can create your uh, create a free website now here we are set up your free website first of all here you have to select your uh, version of uh, wordpress like let's say i want to use 6.1.1 uh, because it's recommended it's recommended and then what is uh, the type of configuration i want to create a default for default it is a basic business website if you want to create a real estate or any kind of basic business website then you can select uh, default if you want to create multi-site system then you can select multi-site and if you want to create an e-commerce store then you can select woocommerce i'll go with default here you will have to add the website name so khadeen the site dot instant wp dot xyz and i'll just click on launch your site instantly in uh, site installation would be done in seconds it would not take a time like other hostings it would be done in seconds and you will get your website uh, within few seconds without anything now for eight hours you can try this website you will have to create a uh, account uh, you will have to create an account first and then you can just try this website you can play around with this website for free you don't have to pay a penny to do that so first of all i'll just add my name khadeen akbar and then email address demo i'm not using my original email address because i already have a subscription on my original email address so i'll just hit sign up and then i have received a, a verification email so i'll pause the video to verify it and here in email you can see I just got my uh, email and password as well and I can just click on verify email address and it will direct me to my page so this is the insta WP dashboard and here is where we will be uh, creating our website and we will be just managing our website here we you can see there are multiple features and I will explain you each and every feature how you can use it and how it is useful for you and how you can utilize those features and first of all let's just explore our website so to visit our website you can just go directly there you can just or or what you can do is you can hit here uh, and you will be directed to the website so this is our disposable website and website will expire in one day and uh, 24 hours this is because it is a free version and they cannot store that much websites and uh, like it's reasonable reasonable for free you can just play around with this website you can check out if insta wp is good for you and then you can upgrade to the pro version as well so uh, uh, here are some of the features first of all you can just go to the website directly or you can add tags to this website then from here uh, by clicking on auto login it would take you to the WordPress dashboard directly so the WordPress dashboard is where you will be editing the website and from where you can just create your complete website here are a lot of the tutorials that you can follow to create real estate website to create e-commerce website or to create any kind of website uh, obviously they will recommend you other hostings but if you uh, think that insta wp is good for you is fast and is more secure then you can uh, create a website using insta wp and rest of the process you can follow that process 
now here uh, this is auto login you can go there and then the second option is reserve website reserve website means that uh, you have created temporary website and you want to go with we that website and you want uh, reserve website means that you don't want this website to expire so when you will select this reserve website it would never expire in future but for this one you will need to upgrade to the pro plan here they have the pricing plans yearly and monthly i have their professional plan this one monthly plan and i'll show you how it works on that but first of all i just want to show all the features with the free one and then i'll show you that how it works with the pro one as well so with the uh, pro, uh, free plan you get uh, 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 disk storage of 1000 mbs then three active sites with the free one and 25 with the professional plan there is agency plan and all that stuff and they are pretty reasonable as well and uh, here you can see uh, a personal plan is 14 dollars per month 29 dollars per month and 79 dollars per month and when you get yearly plan you will get 20 percent off these are all the things you can compare these things uh, like you have uh, multiple options like team members and uh, sandbox sites instant templates etc etc so uh, you can utilize all those features if you want and i'll tell you about all those features and here we have the website created as well and from here we can connect the custom domain to our website as well by custom domain i mean right now it uh, the website address is khadeens site dot insta wp dot xyz but we want uh, a website like Khadeen Akbar so this is the website Khadeen Akbar.com so this is Khadeen Akbar.com here you can see there is an proper address so if you want the proper address on this side you will have to uh, like connect a custom domain name uh, you will have to map the domain and for this one as well you need the pro version but all other things are available with the free version then uh, the second thing is uh, uh, there are a lot other technical options like you can uh, export this website then you have DB editor you can protect the website you have some deployment options and you can also migrate this website and then we have these templates so what you can do is you can convert a website into the template like uh, you can save the website as template uh, add the template name sample website and then add a description here so what happens basically is if you are a developer uh, and uh, there are some of the plugins and some settings that you have to do with all the of the website one by one but here what you can do is you can uh, add all the basic settings to the website and then you can save it as template and in future if you want to create a website for yourself or for your clients you can just use the insta uh, wp template and you can just import the template and all the required like uh, uh, like the plugins like Yoast SEO and these kind of plugins would be stored automatically you can all add all the required plugins into it save it as template and whenever in future you want to create a website you can import the template and that template uh, would make it easy for you to create the website you can save it as template then just go to template and uh, here we have the template and uh, then from here you can create a new site click on create new site and uh, if you want to create a reserved site or temporary site i'll say temporary site and you can create a site and it would create the website for you and here we have the configuration settings and first of all we have general settings so basically these configuration settings are the settings uh, which we would need at the time of installation like uh, we have uh, like uh, you remember that when we installed the website we had different configurations like default woocommerce and uh, dev stack etc etc so these are those configurations and we can make changes to these configurations like we can create a new configuration like i'll say sample configuration a new configuration is added and I'll edit this one by default we have one post in the configuration okay uh, in the basic configuration by WordPress but uh, this uh, this tool give us access that we can 
uh, like ch change the things like we can add a default doggo to it we can add a default uh, php version to it then we have uh, these php settings if we want to change those then we have wordpress settings we want to enable the uh, wp debug or uh, auto update core search engine indexing etc then this what should be the site language uh, and uh, what we want the uh, what we want it for like the username that if we want the multi-site installation or not then by default if we want some plugins to be pre-installed like i want yoast seo so i'll add uh, what we have to do is uh, here uh, from wp repository repository just go to wp repository go to plugins and here search for the plugin that you want like let's say i want yoast seo so i'll just go there this is the Yoast SEO. So this is the uh, slug for this one. I'll just go to configuration. I'll paste it here. WordPress SEO. I'll add it. The WordPress SEO is added. These are all the uh, pre-installed plugins that would be added here. Then I want Elementor. I will search for Elementor and it would be added uh, i'll show you with it uh, i'll show it to you with the premium version how to do it so that's how you can do it with the uh, free version now i'll just log in with the pro version so that i can show you what are the features you will get with the pro version so here you go i have logged in to my uh, pro temp uh, pro admin dashboard and uh, here first of all let me just go to the subscription and here you can see i have got the professional plan which is 29 dollars per month and uh, here i have the sites here i'll see my templates i can see my templates and i can turn my website into template as well and here are the configuration settings so now i'll create a new configuration i'll say sample configuration and then i will just add it and now here um, i can just uh, do these things then go to wordpress and add the themes like wordpress uh, add the plugins wordpress seo then i want elementor what is the slug for elementor elementor then in themes i want let's just go to the themes and in themes i want rishi let's see if rishi is available or no, rishi is not available i want astra and this is astra and uh, i will go to astra this is the slug for astra we'll go there and here i will add the slug for astra and uh, then uh, what we'll do is we'll just save the configuration the configuration has been saved and now we will just go back and i'll just add a new site create a new site this is the sample configuration we created and here i can add the name sample config site and then if i want this reserved site or temporary site because you know about that if it is a reserved site it would not expire and if it is not a reserved site then it would expire we also have an option to import from template if we have any template because i'm with the professional plan we have this store as well it is coming soon it would have some kind of templates you can also see that whenever you are watching video store will be available but i'll select sample configuration reserved site and i'll click on create site it would take few seconds and site would be installed and here you go we have the site this site is reserved site and now by default you will see the plugins are already plugins and themes i selected are already installed these are all the username and password i'll hit magic login to log into my website and i will be easily able to log into my website without any hassle and uh, here you can see now here you can see this is the magic uh, wordpress uh, elementor is already installed and elementor onboarding is here i don't want to create the elementor account so i'll just leave it and uh, here we go we are on elementor astra is already installed used seo is already installed because i added the slugs for it so that's how it works that's how you can add uh, like uh, the sample configurations then you can create the templates for our website i'll say hit uh, template this one click next enter the name of the template 
and select it as instant template or shared template if you share, select shared template it would be public but i'll say private and i'll save it now here we have template and from this template i can create more websites like the new website i'll create from this template would have all the plugins themes and pages like this one then we have another uh, setting let me just go to the dashboard and here in configurations from here uh, we can also select the faker and from the faker I can select the number of post pages tags categories I want to add by default these are one or two but you can add more and more categories and pages would be added to your website I'll just delete the unnecessary pages and uh, so, uh, that's how you uh, uh, like I'll just go to this one this website let me just show you so right now when we'll just go to dashboard and uh, we'll just go to pages we have just uh, one page okay but now if we'll install with this configuration we would have 10 posts by default 10 pages by default six tags by default etc etc then you have the deployment settings um, and then you have the integration settings if you want at any integrations uh, any application to install you select an application like you have uh, mailchimp for right now add add the api keys etc etc if you are a developer you know about it then deployments if you want to add a new deployment a new deployment uh, and uh, then here you have some of the options like uh, list of all the instant wp sites templates etc etc et you can just explore it as well and then here you have analytics uh, what you can use and what you are using then you can also go to add-ons and look for the add-ons uh, if you run out of anything like git operations commands at sandbox sites etc etc et if you want to enable something instant template site export uh, like you want to enable anything from here you can buy or enable anything and it would cost you a few bits and that's all you don't have to upgrade your plan then here in apps you have all the apps with which you can integrate and you have a chrome extension with which you can just manage your instant wp site and you also have slack and uh, then this is our site now very easily because you have extra and rishi like themes rishi th there is extra theme rishi theme you can easily import pre-made templates and you can easily create sites but insta wp makes it easy and it is free to use first of all then you can upgrade to the pro version as well now i'll just hit get started it would just imp enable the starter templates and uh, then from starter templates i can select a site and i can edit with a it with Elementor now if you want to edit site with Elementor I have a lot of tutorials on YouTube about that and uh, there are a lot other tutorials how to use Elementor and how to build a website using Elementor I am doing it by like uh, along with it so from here you would have to select a template you want to import like let's say I want to import this template I'll select this template first of all you will have to upload your logo I'll select the logo of mine um, which logo do I want to select so I'll select this logo this is the logo I'll hit select logo is selected I'll continue the uh, color scheme you want to select I want to select this color scheme then fonts and then continue then uh, if you want to tell a bit about yourself you can tell uh, this tool for my client then I uh, then all this select all this and click on build my website and it would build a complete website for you there are a lot other themes like I'm t telling you like you have vlogs you have uh, um, extra you can uh, use those uh, themes or you can just go to themeforest.com you can just go to themeforest.net here you can just search for wordpress themes and you will get a lot of wordpress themes and you utilizing those you can create a website for you now our website is created a super fast website is created but the main problem is always with the speed of website this uh, hosting insta wp would give you a super fast speed and performance and there would be no problem you have a lot of options like you can create reserved websites you can create websites from templates so if you are a freelancer and if you are creating websites for your clients then this one is best for you that was all about this lecture i hope you liked this video and uh, also if you like the video uh, hit the like button if you have any question just go to comments and um, uh, let me know what is your question and i would, would love to answer your question and one more thing that if you want more videos like that don't forget to subscribe to this youtube channel that was all see you in the next video maybe if you subscribe this